Crime alert we continue to see across the by state. Fairview Heights police have made arrest after coming across copper thefts in the middle of the night. Police say the men caught were trying to steal a copper fiber cable from a communication pole. This latest arrest adding on to several similar cases in just the past couple of days, including in South City and Jefferson County, where thieves targeted wiring from utility poles. All new here at 5 o'clock, our Kimberly Donahue is hearing from police about this latest case and the damage done in Fairview Heights. Law enforcement all over the streets of Fairview Heights early Wednesday morning, finding AT&T fiber optic lines down in the area of 89th and Hillside Avenue. It wasn't an accident, it was a crime. That's ridiculous. You know, everybody should do the right thing. I mean, that's how we become a community. Can't become a community like that. Fairview Heights PD came across the crime while on patrol. They regularly are patrolling that area. They see this wire down on the ground. Um, and they can hear somebody starting to move through the wood line. So they called other officers down there, realized somebody had just, just freshly cut uh, AT&T utility wires down. And that's, that's what led them to this initial search and realized that it was actively in progress theft. Law enforcement says the theft affected at least 100 people, taking down landlines and Wi-Fi. It's the third instance of crimes like this recently across the bi-state. Jefferson County saw 24 thefts during the month of September. Last week, thieves cut through a chain link fence in South City, causing thousands of dollars worth of damage to a cell phone tower. Law enforcement and neighbors alike agree what's most unsettling about this crime is the potential for cutting off people in need from essential services when there might be an emergency. They're disrupting hundreds of people's lives and people are dependent on their internet. It may seem like a minor inconvenience, but if your medical devices go offline or your your phones go out and you know you wake up and you you, you can't you can't do anything that's dependent on the internet. You never know if you're gonna have an emergency then a heater going out and they're stuck in the freezing cold. If they're stealing that, what else are they going to steal? Two men were arrested. Police say the suspects are known to them. In Fairview Heights, Kimberly Donahue, First Alert 4.